Hi everyone, this is Kiss. Welcome to my cooking channel. I went to Chinatown yesterday and then I passed the butcher shop and I saw this. It's a pork ribs with beautiful marblings. So I had to get this. So today I'm gonna show you how to make delicious spicy pork ribs. It's a meun deji galbi in Korean. So I'm gonna start off with seasoning the meat. Let's take it out. Salt. Ground pepper. And push back and flip over and salt again and ground pepper and leave it aside so usually when you cook a pork ribs in Korea we normally soak it in the cold water for a few hours to get rid of all the blood but today I'm gonna get a really nice color so I'm gonna start with the pan fry first so get a pan turn on the heat I'm gonna add a tablespoon of cooking oil So the pan is really nice and hot. So So I'm going to cook for 3 to 4 minutes each side. Pull it over. Look at the color, it's a really golden brown. So it's been cooked for 6 minutes, 3 minutes each side. So I'm gonna turn off the heat. So as you see, it's got really nice color. So now I'm gonna braise this meat. So we need a, another pan. So I'm gonna move this to the new pan. So to braise this meat, I need some broth. So this is a shiitake mushroom. I soaked it in the water three hours ago. So that will be my broth. If you don't have this, and if you haven't got time, then you can use chicken stock, it's fine. Um, so, so for now, I'm gonna add half liter of shiitake mushroom broth. Mushroom as well. So for the seasoning, I've got 8 cloves of garlic and 60 grams of ginger. The, the easy way to fill up the garlic is smash and, okay, <laughs> and it will come off easily like this. So 8 cloves of garlic in and I'm going to slice the ginger. So this is about 40 grams of ginger. And now I need to make spice sauce. 3 tablespoons of soy sauce. One, two, three. And 2 tablespoons of rice wine.
three tablespoons of chili powder. It's gonna be very hot. <laughs> you can do two tablespoons. One, two, three. This is a Korean chili paste. It's called gochujang. You can find this from any Asian grocery shops. One tablespoon. And one tablespoon of sesame oil. And one and a half tablespoon of honey. And mix them all together. Don't forget to taste it. Mm. It's quite good. And I'm gonna add ground pepper. So the salt goes in it. So I'm gonna cook this for 20 minutes without the lid one with high heat. And then I'm gonna lower the heat to medium heat and then I'll cook it with a lid on with a medium heat. Now it's been simmering for 15 minutes actually. So I'm gonna turn off the heat. Um, as you see, the sauce has evaporated and the thickened down. It's almost gone. So now I'm gonna cook it with a low heat and that will make the meat really tender. Um, also, I'm gonna add radish. It will give it really rich flavors. This time I'm gonna cook it with the lid on. Half an hour. So in the meanwhile, I'm gonna prepare all the vegetables. One onion. Sixty gram of carrot. One twenty gram of leek. I cut through the middle and then I rinse all the layers. So it's been simmering for half an hour with low medium heat and I added another 200 milliliter of broth and as you see the all the sauce is gone so I'm gonna turn off the heat I'm gonna take the meat out of the pan Turn on the heat back. High heat. Now we're gonna cook the vegetable with the left sauce, as you see. All in. Make sure you don't overcook all the veggies because I want them to stay crunch. I'm gonna turn off the heat. So I'm gonna place on the plate.
and I got some garnish. Ta-da! So I made spice pork rib today. Look at this. Look at the color. It looks delicious, doesn't it? Oh my goodness! I can't wait to taste. So I made meun deji galbi today with my own twist. I am so excited. Let me taste this so I can tell you what it tastes like. Oh my god. Oh, it's so soft. Mm. Wow. Mm. Mm, it's good. Mm. Fireworks going on in my mouth. So much flavors. And the meat is so tender and so succulent. When I chew it, all the juice is coming out. Also, the radish is cooked perfectly. It absorbed all the sauce as well. Mmm, it's delicious. Mmm. Mmm. Mushroom. Mm. Oh my god, this is so delicious. If you liked my recipe, try at home. You'll love it. It's so, so tasty. Thank you so much for watching, guys. I will see you next time. Bye.